Jingle bells ringing in my ear. Jingle bell a sound that's oh so dear. Frosty the snowman is all around town. Watch out for rain, these are falling down. We stay up waiting for Santa tonight. He climbs down the chimney at the speed of light. While we're dancing around the Christmas tree. Hugging and kissing just you and me. Carolers are singing outside our door. Love Everyone, it is the 9th of December, Saturday the 9th of December and I didn't get round to showing you my bed of roses advent so far. So in here, I've not opened today's up, I've got all these beautiful mini skeins and I decided I'm not in no rush, I'm going to wait till I've opened them all up and decide what I'm going to do. If I'm if I'm gonna make the Skiri's Colorwork wrist warmers, which at the minute I still really want to do them because they look beautiful. I got a full skein of this one. Um, this one was the one that I opened up on the first day, which is stunning. And I'm not sure if I've shown these two. I mean, look at these colours, aren't they absolutely stunning? And then I've got these mini ones. And then there were some lovely, there were more sachets of tea and some sweets, which you can imagine they've all gone now. I've not seen this one before, the puck of tea, the black currant beauty. And, oh, that sounds nice, doesn't it? Deliciously deep purple fruits to help you glow inside and out. I could do with a bit of that. I don't know about you, but I definitely could do with a bit of that. And each day I've been adding the charms onto here. Look at this. I've got one of them actually on one of my projects, which I will show in a minute. But I've got lovely snowflake, this really pretty gem, uh, like a heart, antique style heart with a gem in the middle. These little stones, these precious stones are so sweet. Love the keys. And the crown, look at the crown. Love that, so that's on there. I'm still saving these little ones here, which you can open up any time. There's no date on these ones. I'm still saving them for a minute, um, but I've not opened up today actually. So I'm gonna grab that one while I'm over here chatting to you. And then I'm going to grab number nine. There it is. That didn't take long. And then ten. Where's not? There's nine. Let's grab number nine. This one. Open up these. And then I'll get my sticker advent as well. I was going to show you them. Actually, I might do that. Take you over here. I've given things a bit of a tidy up. Let me move this out of the way on it. I've given things a bit of a tidy up over here. I've got, oh, that's so funny, I've got Woody's, that's Woody's hat from Toy Story. I've got that just on some journaling books um, and some wildflowers, butterflies and moths. And then I've got this really sweet little wooden house, which I picked up from a charity shop. There are little hanging metal um, attachments on the back of it, if I did want to ever put it on the wall. Um, but I've just got it on the top part of this shelf at the minute. And then I've just got some little random bits up here at the minute. So I'm still, I'm still trying to get myself organised and sorted, but I thought it was just so sweet to put all my little stamps in here. So you would have seen the other day um, I showed this one. And what other one did I show? Did I show that one? That's a recent new one and that one. And I've just got some paint brushes in here, my watercolour paint brushes, and then I tend to put like sticker flakes in here. Um, there's there's bits and pieces of everything in there. Um, little tea light there, and then down here, I've got my Delphonics pouch, 
really would like to get a smaller version of this one. It's perfect, but I do fancy a smaller one, which would be brilliant to carry in my handbag. Um, I picked these up, actually. I got these. I ordered them from Amazon. They are sticky dots. Um, I can go through that, actually. Kind of like, you know, online, on YouTube, I love watching what's in my makeup bag or what's in my handbag or what's in my notions bag. You could do a what's in my a stationary bag I could do that and then I've got all my pens over here anytime Jesse draws me anything I put it over here I've got little pictures I just love seeing hand-drawn she made me this as well just love having things like this on my desk it just makes me makes me smile and fills my heart um she wrote a little note for the elf not to be really naughty Dear Mr. Elf, please can you not be, please can you not do really naughty, I think she was trying to say things, oh there you go, things. Oh, my hand, hand did a little shake then, didn't it? Um, I normally have my journals up here, but I was having a little sort out, so they're just here in this bit now. Um, I finally put on my polar bear charm. I did put my little brass tag on here, but I couldn't find any pliers, so I'm going to be putting it here when I get a minute. And that's a stitch marker. I've just brought this over here to open up. But these are, oh, I'm just opening up the chair. Oh, and I need to show you some project bags. I'm sat down now. Um, and then in here, I've got one of these acrylic trays, which You've probably seen a lot of people use these trays for various things. Makeup, arts and crafts. They are brilliant for stamps. So I've got a few stamps in here. And also I've got these little um, ink pads. Is it going to focus? There you go. They're great because you literally pop your finger in. And then you can dab it on the stamp. I've got a few of them. They go right back there and I've put them into, I've kind of tried to put them into colour families. So I've got stamps here and then I've got some more stamps in here and I've started to collect these stamps now. Might better hear Jessie in the background sniffing. <laughs> Bless her. And oh, they were the washi tapes I got the other day. I showed you them, didn't I? I kind of just stuck my washi tapes up here at the minute um, and my pet tapes and I've just got some receipts in there that I want to use for journaling and there's other bits in there um, that I, I'd love to take out and show you and then up here I've got some alphabet wooden stamps I've got some ink there some tins and more um, little bits and pieces I've got this really beautiful postcard actually I need to put this out Love that. Yeah, this is from one of my favourite brands. Um, I never know how to pronounce it. Is it Le, Le Dolce Vita? I've got lots and lots of their pet tapes. And I think there's even a few more since I last got them. That I need to, um, well I don't need to, but I'd like to add to my collection. And this is my own troll so that is a, an original 90s troll is it were they in the 90s were they 90s can't remember now or were they 80s i guess they'd be 80s wouldn't they oh i don't know all i know is it's um he's an original right okay let me, shall I open these, take these all out and show you? I'll do that. Then I'll be back. you know it's Christmas When the snow starts to fall Then you know it's Christmas For the children above all Then you know it's Christmas Cause Santa's on his way Stand under the mistletoe And then it's Christmas 
Christmas Day The joyful times we witness Forever stays with us Soon Rudolph hears his whistle And gathers all his friends When Santa and his missus Wraps the final gift You know it's time for Christmas For each and every that I didn't get around to showing you my new book that I picked up from my bookshelf so I've already I'm literally sat on the sofa just finishing off yesterday's episode which will go up hopefully in a bit and yeah I've totally forgot to pick up the camera and show you this book so I've had this sat on my bookshelf for a little while now and I've been saving it for to read around Christmas time, hence the title. I thought it was a standalone story, but in actual fact, it's six individual tales, and I just read a little bit about it. Um, the genres, it, they describe the stories as chilling thriller style stories. I've never read any of Val McDermid, um, any of her books before, but I have seen a few of her books in the charity shops, so let me know if you think I might enjoy her her other books and if you've got any favourites. I always love to read your book recommendations and the front cover definitely looks like it is a Angela Harding one, doesn't it? It's absolutely beautiful. Look at that robin. Gorgeous. I definitely think that is definitely Angela Harding. I've had tried to have a little look inside the book, but it doesn't give any... Um, Oh, what's the word? Um, recognition. I'm, I'm sure it is. Um, so, and I've just added on the next day on my granny stripe shawl. So I'm going to sit here, finish off editing yesterday's episode. I've got a cup of tea. I've got the Christmas lights on. Jessie snuggled next to me. Brightly shining. It's the night. Of the dear Savior's birth Long lay the world in sin and error pining Till he appeared and the soul felt its worth A thrill of hope The weary world rejoices for Yonder breaks a new and glorious morn. Fall on your knees, oh, hear the angel voice says, Oh, night divine, the night. Christ was born Oh no 